Tags is the name for Moultrie Mobile's advanced species recognition software that uses AI technology. And what it does is it scans every image that comes in and it looks for specific species such as deer, buck, doe, turkey, vehicle, person. And just released in the test phase is four new ones, bobcat, coyote, bear, and hog. And this is a free application inside the Moultrie Mobile app. And we're going to show you several ways of utilizing that. One of the easiest ways to use smart tags is to quickly scan through images. So if you want to just look at bucks, you can come over here to filters, click on smart tags, and click on the buck option. Then come over here and click apply, and it'll give it a minute, let it load. And this is going to filter through all your images and only show you those images with bucks in it. So you don't have to look at all the doe pictures or raccoon pictures and you can quickly see what's on camera and see if that buck that you're after showed up. And here you'll see it's now loaded so we're going to click on this and scan through these images and see. So you see there's a buck, same buck there. So now I've gone through and I don't have to look at all those images that I'm not interested in and I can look for bucks only and see if my target bucks on camera. Another way to utilize smart tags is to get notifications on your phone. Come up here to the top icon, click on notifications and then scroll down and you'll notice the smart tags down here. You'll also see that the new smart tags aren't yet down here and that's because they're still in the testing phase and I'll speak more to that in a minute. But if you want to get a notification on your phone for if you run one camera or ten cameras, you can get a notification for any of those if a buck image uploads. So say we want bucks, I click on that, click save. We will now get a notification on our phone every time a buck image uploads. Or if you want to come up here and get it only for a specific camera, click here and scroll through your camera list. And so we'll say third stand, I'd like to get notifications there, go back down, and again, now I can say, all right, I want to get buck images from third stand only, click save, now hit OK. Now every time that a buck enters there and a picture is taken and uploaded, I'll get a notification on my phone for that. Another great option with smart tags and notifications is for security purposes. And if you'll scroll down again, you'll notice there's person and vehicle. So the AI technology can pick apart and see if a person or a vehicle is in any of your images and automatically apply that smart tag. And if we click on those and click save, we'll now get a notification on our phone if any of our cameras pick up a person or vehicle in them. And again, say you have cameras doing specific work, you can set that notification for a specific camera. And that way, say you have one that's maybe on your hunting camp or at your house or something, and you know, you know which one that is, you can select that specific one and go down and set your notifications for it. And that way, say you have cameras that are out there for hunting, and maybe you have one or two set up for security, this gives you the freedom to set them up that way. All right, so we're gonna click on smart tags again. And earlier I was talking about our new ones that are in the test phase. And these are in the test phase because we need Moultrie Mobile users to help teach the AI software uh, if it's correct or not. So you can go in here, I encourage you to click on all these and hit apply, and it's gonna apply it to the images now. So one of those new smart tags is in any of these images. So we'll click on this one, and here we can clearly see it's a coyote. So let's see if it's right. We'll hit details, and there, it applied that correctly. So we're gonna tell the system, yes, you were right. And let's go to another one and see perhaps if it was wrong. So here we can see this is a deer walking, it's a deer head. Let's see what the details say it is. So here the system tagged this as a coyote. We can clearly see that's wrong. So now you want to click no. And clicking no on the ones that are incorrect is going to teach the system more than anything. 
And that's where we encourage all the Moultrie Mobile users to try out these new smart tags and just spend a little time going through, clicking no on the ones that are wrong, uh, because that's essentially what's going to help train the system, make it smarter, more accurate. And uh, the more users that do that, the quicker those will be released and they'll be highly accurate at that point.